All right, peace to the true ones. Okay, I'm going to make a video about these false prophets and what's been happening to them. Like, the warning has been put out to all of them. Every last single one of them. Okay? And I want to show you the work that I've been doing before I even came back to YouTube to show y'all that I'm not playing with these motherfuckers. All these false prophets and people that are saying that they the Messiah and... Just people trying to sit on other people's thrones. I'm going to show you what I've been doing to all of them. And what made me make this video is because of this comment that um, I received not too long ago that said, um, you saw Israel said they found the Messiah and blew their horn. This this the last winter and nobody believe in me. I'm finna keep it real and do what I'm doing and also decode everything that's coming from the true soul and program self especially these rap songs many 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 men which death upon me and i said yep when they found him their vi their village caught on fire and um i'm gonna show you some things about all this too so first let's get into this bitch amy carlson okay she was the leader of the Love Has One cult. And it's crazy because all these motherfuckers always end up somewhere in Hawaii. And they went right to the island where I where I used to live. Just like the Lori Vallow bitch. <laughs> all these people that's in cults. I swear to God. Who, who else? Uh, well, Young Pharaoh wanted to move to um, Hawaii. And um, who else? Nature Boy. He moved to Big Island. Got kicked out. These motherfuckers don't last there. Cause there's an energy there's a strong spiritual energy that you can see from space in hawaii and only the true and living can live there and dwell there that's why i was lit uh, i was there i was there for almost a decade till i had to come back here and open the bottomless pit that's the only reason why i came back was to open the bottomless pit and get this shit rocking but these cults they don't last long in hawaii because of the spiritual energy that's there protecting those people okay like those people are those those man they some warriors over there in hawaii that's why they over there that's why they always over there trying to fuck with them because it's, it's always been a spiritual battle they know who they are they didn't lose their culture like everybody else did even though they, they tried to take it from them and, but there's individuals there that kept it alive okay there's individuals, there's Kapuna and Kahuna there that stayed there and kept the culture alive, okay? There's tutus, there's, there's, there's teachers there still that's teaching ancient practices. And they, they, they know that their land is sacred and they, they, they get their lives in Hawaii for their land. Okay, I love Hawaii, man. I told you that's where I was born at. That's where I was, like, this version of me, my soul... <laughs> In more ways than one, like the energy there is dope, and I'm I'm glad that I I got rooted in Hawaii. But this motherfucker, it was going down in Hawaii over there. She went up to Hyena, and um, her ass got <laughs> kicked the fuck out of Hawaii. Then they tried to go to Maui, and then they like, nah, y'all, you motherfuckers, y'all gotta go back to Colorado, okay? But Paley was over there. They they was down there burning shit up in their yard on the beach they was down there man i sent everybody down i sent the night marchers and pele down there to fuck this bitch up and, um they was down there chanting everything the hawaiian people and and some locals that's not hawaiian but they know that they have to protect the land to even continue living there because you like the land will disperse of you the land will get rid of you if they don't want you there. They, the land in Hawaii will get rid of you immediately. That's how precious and sacred Hawaii is. Okay? You won't be there for long at all if you're not Pono. Okay? You won't be there at all for long. <laughs> okay? And you'll get dragged the whole time that you're there. Anyway, she died. This bitch died. Okay? And I told this bitch that she was going to die because she fucking with the great mother and great father. They said, y'all should have, she, oh my God, she just shrunk, like, quickly. She just got skinnier and skinnier every month, okay? And she was an alcoholic and a drug addict, all right? But she told the mother, she she told the motherfuckers that she was the great mother. She said, I'm the mother guy, okay? I don't play about me and my wife. Look what I told 
look what I told her uh, her cult followers, her um, her right hands. I said your leader is dead and not ascended. I told y'all, y'all are going down. Karma for playing with God. She would say, buckle up, buttercup. I said, bitch, you going to jail? What the fuck? They desecrated that bitch's body. They found her body deceased and wrapped like a mummy. Cause they thought she was gonna rise again. No, 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 no. The bitch died, okay? We got that bitch. We got her ass up out of there. We got her ass up out of here. Just like I'm finna get rid of another motherfucker. Me and my family, we finna get rid of your ass too. Y'all know who I'm talking about. That bitch that thinks she the great mother. All of them, for real. Only the true one is supposed to sit on his throne. That's it. Go find your own. Who are you? Go sit on your own seat. I'm killing all these false prophets and false messiahs and false great mothers and false great fathers. All of them that come in me and my family's name and they're not us putting in this work. They're going to die and I'm going to keep letting all of them know that they're going to die. Don't play with God. Don't play with me. Don't play with my wife and don't play with our children. Period. I'm going to kill you all. Just like this bitch and many others that have died as well or are in jail awaiting their death. They're all going to die. It's, ine it's inevitable. Young and old, y'all just like that little boy who thought he was the Prince of Peace and the King of Heaven at the same time, because his his retarded mother um, grew him to be that way. She raised him to be thinking that he's somebody that he's not, and that bitch is in trouble too. And y'all seen that he recently died last month. The false, the false Jalen for playing with God. Y'all think I'm not finna kill each and every last one of these motherfuckers? And every time I tell you motherfuckers that they gonna die, they die. They get, they just get dragged first. That's all. Now we let's get back to Israel, cause when Israel said that they found they fought their false uh, prophet, big ass sinkholes just started appearing everywhere. Um, Netan Netanyahu got ousted as the um Israeli prime minister. Okay, he got kicked the fuck out, and he been dead. He been dead, but they had to kick him out. You know what I mean? Um, look, 18 buses myster mysteriously uh, burned to cinders in Israel. Look at the dates. They're all around the same time. June. Uh, it's going to be like from, from April to June. Maybe um, a little bit earlier than that. Uh, in 2021, where, where, when this fucking false prophet came out and said he was the Messiah in Israel. And, and they crowned him that. In Israel, look, it's a power. Um, it's an explosion at the power plant in Israel. You see this? Do you see my wife's face? I can see my wife's face in that fire right there. My wife's face is in that fire. Okay. Um, in April, April fifth, twenty twenty one is when um, they reported on this dude being presented as the Messiah. Okay. The king of Israel, okay? They say his name is Jezekiah, which is Ezekiah, Ben David, which means the strength of God. And he was 30 years old. I say was because he dead. Y'all just don't know he dead. Okay. Um, the motherfucker's dead, okay? Uh, I said, well, the false Messiah has arrived in Israel. If anyone wondered, he was crowned king of Israel yesterday. The whole town about to burn down. This was April 5th, and I just showed y'all this, this motherfucker on fire. Um, Look, May, look. See, April, May, like, look, the next month. As soon as I said, look, in April, I said that bitch about to burn down. Look what happened in May. Like I said, fire is coming down heavy on Israel for announcing a false messiah when the real messiah is living right here in the heart of America. Okay? All right? It was just a matter of time before the Temple of Mount... The, the Temple Mount in Jerusalem, as predicted, took center stage in a series of unprecedented trend of events that are about to unfold in the Holy Land. All, Israel started burning down. This bitch started burning down right after. I said, Israel's still burning for crowning a false messiah. Never play with God because God will come for you. Wildfires all throughout Jerusalem. This was June 9th, 2021. Okay, I don't play about me and my wife. In our children. Okay. I said, well, Israel on fire. Just like I said, um, they would be for the false messiah. And they announced a couple months back. Now they got to deal with bombs and dragon fire. <laughs> uh, 
Okay. 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 And this is just the love is one cult where, where um, the bitch was like, uh, she was a great mother. And then she had some dude there pretending to be the great father. And I told them fire was, was, was going to go everywhere they went. Okay, I told the motherfuckers, uh, fire finna go everywhere y'all go. So, um, did I even show you that place on fire? It's in Moffitt. I think I did. But, um, see the sinkhole swallowing that bitch up? Um, let me see. I don't know if I played that whole thing for y'all. Let me see. Let me see. Let me go back. Yeah, this bitch was on fire. Look at this shit. This motherfucker's on fire. Look, I said, this is where the Love Has One cult is, and they call it the Moffat House. That cult disrespected the great mother and father, and I told them fire will go everywhere that they they went, right? Even in, while they was in Hawaii. Look, down here you see it says Moffat County, Colorado, where they where they was um where their headquarters is at. Uh, man, I don't play. I don't play about me and my energy. I don't play about my wife, which is the great mother, and I don't play about none of our child, our none of our true children at all. I will kill everything on this planet about my family. I I don't play at all. And motherfuckers, I don't know why they're not learning their lesson, okay? And I know they all going through shit right now, even though I don't give a fuck what a motherfucker if I told you that a motherfucker is in trouble in here, trust me, they in trouble. And they just not showing you how much trouble they in and how bad their life really is because i don't play at all like i said i drag you every day of your life you're gonna feel me when you disrespect me and my family okay and that's <laughs> that's a big dot right there so if a motherfucker on here acting like ain't nothing going on with them you know and they constantly trying to um prove that ain't nothing going on in their life that's when you that's a red flag that something going on in their life and they feeling it and all of this is a diversion. <laughs> okay, this is a part of their own magic. You know, that's them and their own magic trying to um, create an illusion. But in a minute, everything will be full blast in real time. And everybody going to see it, okay? And that's all I wanted to say. Never be an Amy. Because this is what happened. Death becomes her. Peace to the true ones. And the true ones only. And so it is. Ashe.